Hi Gemini and welcome back to my channel. My name is Renee and this is New Angel Tarot. Thank you so much for joining me. Today's reading is going to be your weekly sun sign prediction starting March the 28th, 2022, which is Monday, March the 28th, 2022. Gemini, I hope you are well. So as usual, I'm just going to give you guys a quick three card spread with an overarching energy and a clarifier. And that's pretty much it. It's a simple, short, sharp and shiny reading. I hope you enjoy it. Um, and this a week as well i'm using my fairy tarot i haven't used this one for a while so um i'm just feeling yeah a bit foresty a bit nature based um and a little bit a little bit mystical as well i'm just sort of feeling like this is the deck i should be using for this week so i hope you enjoy the reading let's get started angel spirits guides angel spirits guides what does gemini need to know for the week ahead march 28th 2022 oh okay Okay, you've got the, the priest, the seven of pentacles. Oh, and then the outcome. Beautiful. Wow, overarching energy is the uh, moon on the bottom of the deck. And let's clarify that. This is really fast. And clarifying that is the hermit. All right, beautiful. You've got four major arcana cards in your reading today, Gemini. You've got the priest, or also known as the hierophant. Okay, starting out here, the Seven of Pentacles and Ace of Wands as an outcome. Overarching energy is the Moon and the Hermit. So I'll hold them up uh, when I um, go through them one by one. So let's get started. Um, Gemini, this week when you're starting out on the 28th of March, you are definitely in your element when it comes to um, spiritual teaching, showing others um, the way in which they can um, kind of you're sort of showing people how to disconnect from the 3D world this week. Um, there's an energy here as well, which is Taurian energy. Um, you know, you're working really hard to get where you want to go and you're really disciplined in all areas of spiritual learning. Um, and I feel like that's going to be the key to the week for you this week, Gemini. So if you've been sort of reading up on things that interest you, whether it be astrology or Reiki or runes or tarot, hi, um, you know, this is a great week for you to do that um, because I feel like you're reassessing, all right, and you've got Seven of Pentacles here at the center of your reading. Gemini, it's time to reassess what it all means, you know, where you're at, what you're doing, what makes you happy, what brings you joy, you know, and where you want to be in 2022. You know, we're always pretty much the last, um, the tail end of the quarter starting this week, so end of March, we're already three months in. Um, and look, the summer has gone, you know, really, really quickly, but I feel like, you know, this week you're sort of knuckling down, preparing for winter, you know, autumn is coming or autumn is here, but it's also a case of, um, yeah, reassessing where you want to go because I feel like you're about to start something new here, Gemini. There's an ace of wands here. Ace of wands is about working on the self, self, uh, what brings you, as I said, what brings you joy, what you're passionate about. Um, and aces are all about new beginnings and as well, um, you know, taking a new, uh, a new direction. You know, aces can also indicate or ace of wands can indicate new creative endeavors, creative projects. Could be a, a home business or something where you become self-employed. Um, so that's also definitely the story that I'm reading here today. You've got the moon card as your overarching energy, and it's clarified here by the hermit, which is really interesting. So we've got Pisces energy and Virgo together. Um, it's really interesting. There is going to be a um, Jupiter and Neptune conjunction in Pisces uh, on the 14th of April, which is coming up mid next month. And this is going to be a time for you, Gemini, also to um, expand on you know, your creativity um, and use your intuition as much as possible. But it also requires you to take a step back as well from probably socializing and really getting to know yourself properly before you make that first big move. Because as I said, you're about to start something new here where it comes to passion projects and things like that. But at the same time, you know, you're going through this beautiful moon energy this week, um, but also an essence of knowing thyself and really just taking a step back for yourself, um, you know, really enjoying your own time, your privacy, and being able to connect with just you, you know, nobody else, just you. So Gemini, I hope you wrote, uh, enjoyed this reading uh, and you found it helpful. If you did, please give my video a thumbs up. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. And if you'd like a personal reading, I can be contacted in the information below on my website, newangeltarot.com. 
And there's also um, some links there as well if you're interested in learning tarot. I've got two really action-packed, short, sharp and shiny courses I'm running. There's a three-week advanced course for those who um, are very comfortable with reading tarot cards and they've done their homework in previous courses or they've been doing it a long time. Um, this is something that I've put together to kind of reinforce certain things around astrology, numerology and the Kabbalah. I am very light on Kabbalah, um, so don't be afraid. But also, if you're just starting out, like straight up, or you just sort of, you started out once before and you never really got to fully understanding uh, the basics and fully comprehending um, the way in which you can read tarot, um, because I know that there are a lot of books out there, there's a lot of information, there are a lot of YouTube videos, there's all that kind of stuff. But I managed to put it all together in a six-week course for you, um, and it's only one hour a week, it's online, it's with me, in person, live. Um, and they're starting uh, on, in April, so April the 6th. So that's my next intake for the next six-week uh, course. Um, it's only $300 Australian for the whole course, which is really reasonable. I don't think you're going to find that anywhere else. Um, and you'll be coming out a really confident reader in terms of being able to understand the tarot because the way I teach, I feel, is um, pretty neat. And you'll have a few laughs along the way. So Gemini, I hope you really uh, enjoyed the reading. As I said, please get in touch. I'd love to hear from you. Leave me some comments below and good luck with your uh, new adventure this week. I hope it's a good one. So take care and thanks for watching.